Then we're back. Because I didn't show you what the fist does, it gives you a bunch of combos. The best one is the rush. And always rush. Yeah. Do you get a Robo Dog? No. Uh... This is not that game. But we're close. <laughs> now, Malicious, like a lot of other games in PlayStation, for some reason, gets a really badass. PS Vita version, which is better than this, because it has, like, another set of bosses, yeah. more powers and more abilities, and I'm like, fucking, I want it. I enjoy the Vita for what it is, but at the same time, if I want to play a console game, I'm going to play it off my console or my PC, not a dinky hand. Dinky. I wouldn't say it's dinky. And you know, if you want a bunch of JRPGs, go for the Vita. It has all of them. Or the regular PSP. No, but it has ones that the PSP doesn't. And you can get and you can download PSP games on your Vita. I wish there was a way to put the actual PSP discs in the game. That's no, it's not happening. Ah. And that is our Lance Power. It's a shockwave ability, mostly. So we're fighting two giant Gatling guns with a guy in between them? Uh, more like a cannon and a Gatling gun. And a Drill spear. He's drilling us. Yeah. Yeah. He's gonna pierce the heavens. And that's He's gonna pierce shooting. our heavens. If you know what I mean. <laughs> We're gonna get both. You know, you should have played as a girl for this one then. Nope. I see how it is. Actually, it, it was all dependent on who I showed off, mostly depending on what counter I could get. Because counters in this game are really picky. You don't need them. You're just cool to show off. But man, I hate this guy's counter so much. Because you have to be like in a... Like... For the... Mole... Guy. All you have to do is be at the center of the screen. And like slightly move forward. Just... It's positioning. Because he's gonna do that falling down to the ground move all the time. For the um... This guy... He's always gonna do an attack where he can do a sword counter to this. Have to be in a perfect spot. He's gotta use that rifle move. It's it's a mess. I got lucky that this popped up. But now that I did, his cannon's gone. This guy's pretty easy. It, only when he gets into his second phase. Which I really enjoy. Everybody has a second face. I couldn't tell with the second guy because you killed him so quick. Well, it's when he got all angry and turned the screen blue. But this guy, you can really tell. Because he, um, kind of starts to fly. <laughs> oh, yeah. He learns how to... Yeah, I can... That's, that's noticeable. Yeah. And this guy's another reason why I'm playing on easy mode, because he's a cunt. Fucking... He flies around all the time, and I'm not having that. It takes way too long. Because the best mode of attack becomes your, you know, your projectiles, and they're the weakest. But fighting this guy's really good with um, practicing your um, perfect guarding. Look, he's flying away like a bitch. Well, he doesn't want to die. Well, he shouldn't pick a fight with me. Well, Actually, no, I, I think picked you pick. Yeah. Well, so fuck him. <laughs> oh, look at me! I can fly. No, you can't anymore. Yeah. You big bully. They're evil now. It doesn't matter. Oh. 
Eee. And now we can fly. A move that I don't use all that often. And we can also flow in the air. I thought you were somewhat kind of already doing that. Yeah, but we can, like... We can float higher off the air. Like, we can only float, like, three feet. Now we can float six. Ten, twenty. Fuck, we could beat skyscrapers. Light is something that you'll only really get to use at the end of the game. I mean, there's another boss fight that we're about to fight right now, where it's kind of useful, but you don't really need it. You do need it, though, if you want to do the counter. Here's an example. See how many times I can jump now? Michael Jordan wish you could be me. A small blue-haired girl. Now I'm just floating like a boss. Fucking yeah, particles. Yeah, frost your arm, having your arms crossed, having particles fly around you. I don't even have to. I don't even have to change my stance. I can just float around like this. That f looks so fucking cliche. What arm cross pose? But that's the most badass pose. Well, you want people to do the peace sign when they go into go into a fight? It's like I'm gonna kill you. Peace. All right, our next boss. He's the shield guy, which means he's the most annoying. A giant dragoon tank? I got more of a goat. A floating goat. That's fucked up. Alright, so... Before we take out the boss, take out these battlements, because they're annoying as hell. Well, while we're doing that, uh, let's get back into the story real quick, because I glanced over it. Like I said before, the king was a douche, and the queen was the benevolent, nice queen that everybody loves. And because of that, the king wasn't having any of her shit and sent her to the dungeon. And her children managed to break her out, her son and her daughter. And you know, the queen's been in there, she's been broken, she's all sad and whatnot. But the, like, those sages guys who we met at the beginning, they showed up before her, offered her ultimate power at the cost of her Sanity. children. No, at the cost of her children or her country and she wasn't having any of that so she went fuck you guys I'm gonna save the day she did but the king did manage to come back and you know put dampered rain on their parade so in their fight her daughter trying her best to make her father feel something took her own life obviously it failed because the king's just that much of a dick and then the son, remembering the prophecy from before, takes his life to give his mother ultimate power. Just wanted to make that a bit more So, clear. who the fuck are we playing as? We're playing as the, um, incarnation. The, the, uh, not the incarnation, but the, um, the mages, they made their own doll because they realized that, hmm, getting random people to work for us is probably a bad idea. How about we do it ourselves? So, you know, the queen, you know, went crazy with power and sent it into darkness, and now we have to stop her. It's yes. ironic because they gave her that power to stop the malice in the world, only for and her yes, she to bring more malice worse. into the world. You sage guys kind of fucked it up. This is why you never trust royalty. Well, no, you never trust, like, prophetic sages, because they manage to fuck things up. Like, how many, like, movies and stories have you seen where the sages were like, Oh, we'll protect that these people will save the world. How about you fuckers save the world? 
Uh, Ocarina of Time. They didn't save the world, they still put it all on Link. At least they weren't evil assholes. In fact, half of them didn't even know they were they were important. Um, Twilight Princess? Those are mystical entities. I don't... Like, you get to the... The stages only appear, like, at the end of the game, really. And even then, all they did was, like, we sealed Ganon away. Fucking kill him! <laughs> kill him in the Nintendo game. But that's what you do! All the goddamn time! Sure you do! You do! He just gets reincarnated like you do! I don't remember dying over and over again. Cause you don't see it. It's called age. <laughs> you just die, you don't get murdered. There's a difference. <laughs> you just die. <laughs> But this guy, he's pretty much just... Yeah, he's just annoying. I don't like this guy. A part of me is hoping you'll grab him and suplex him. No, the best we can do is just fly through his body. Um, speaking of flying through his body, you need to have the flight ability. Because I... If you just have Lance and you're, like, high enough, which you can get, you can activate it, but, you know, it won't finish the job. And here's his second form. Fucking shield, goddamn you. Quit making things complicated. Just let me murder you. You're supposed to freaking use shield break, man. There's no move like that. God damn it. But I think there's. Well, the good thing about this game is that there's friendly fire on. So, you know, them shooting him makes this easy. Fucking morons. They gotta hit me no matter what. I just love the desperation though. It's like I don't have an arm and a leg. Beat him up anyway. <laughs> I will kill you! Even though you're just a tank. You killed a tank. Do you feel pleased? It's a demonic tank. And now I have shield power, so yeah. I feel pretty damn good. Wouldn't that be great in life? Like Mega Man, just beat something up and you get his power. Eh, yeah, just give me the gem shield and I'll be set No, fuck life. you, dude. I eat a plant, I have photosynthesis. Sorry, but that ability has not... What? I don't think that ability has entered Mega Man yet. It doesn't matter if it enters Mega Man, it's, it's the fact that I gain another ability. I'm slowly getting better with these fades. Slowly, but surely. Guard Bash, um... It sends out, like, a pulse that sends enemies away. I think I managed to use it once. It's a it's a pretty hard move to actually maneuver off of. Because you gotta click in the third stick. It's kind of awkward. Uh, the next time is the Forbidden Floor. We have to end things with the Mad Queen herself.